the parents of that student pretty frustrated with the Jackson Intermediate Center and the South Bend School Corporation uh, after what they're saying a lack of response. Now they are asking why their daughter's bullies are not being dealt with. I can't say 100% what they're doing, but I know what they didn't do. Julian Hassan showing pictures of his daughter, Kieris' bloody and bruised face. She had blood rushing all down her face and her the front of her shirt was soaked. Aftermath of what Kiera says was a schoolyard ambush. And then she snatched me from behind and started beating me on my forehead. Kiera, mm -hmm. an eighth grader at Jackson Intermediate Center, said a fellow student did this. Just one of the many attacks that she said she received last school year. Pushing me and calling me names, calling me horse and other names like that. She says she's reported each and every instance of the bullying using the school's bully reporting system. A student fills out the time, place, and a description of the bullying and later turns it into teachers. They would just talk to me or say, that doesn't phase you, you shouldn't let it phase you or whatever, but it does. And now her parents want answers. We started calling people. We started sending out emails. We did all of this and nothing has happened. They even filed a police report with the South Bend Police Department detailing the alleged attack. Hassan's father said that the prosecutor's office told him that there wasn't enough evidence to move forward. We're going to sue the South Bend Community School Corporation because we feel that they are allowing this bullying culture. A rep with the school corporation saying that they're taking this very seriously. The corporation's bully policy states that students who are caught bullying are subject to disciplinary action, including expulsion. Uh, I I'm wondering, are they going to wait until another child's life is taken before they choose to do something? This is a serious matter. A serious matter that Hassan says will most likely continue into this next school year coming up in only two days school coming up pretty soon how do you feel terrible because nothing has happened and nobody has done anything like they don't care the Hassan family even reaching out to the mayor his office confirming to me that they received a call from the family asking for help. They said that they would pass along their request to the superintendent here in South Bend. Now the photos that you saw in the story just now are gaining a lot of traction out on Facebook. Many people coming forward and saying that they too had similar experiences with their students at Jackson Intermediate Center. I'm live in South Bend, Kylie Walker, ABC 57 News.